All right, so today what we're gonna do is we are going to finally settle the score. Which spicy chicken sandwich is better? Popeyes or Chick-fil-A. If you're on Instagram, you saw that I ran that poll and I was shocked at how many people haven't tried the Popeyes spicy sandwich. Team Popeyes. <laughs> Team Chick-fil-A. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was even more shocked that there's people out there that haven't tried Chick-fil-A yet. So today's episode is going to be us comparing the two and seeing which is best. Side by side comparison. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna buy one of each. This is what we're gonna keep everything in until we get to the store. Where'd you leave them? I need keys to the store so I could do this review properly. Go get one of the copies. Have the keys, please. All right, we're gonna start on today's adventure. I forgot the warmer. I forgot what? the warmer. What warmer? Oh. Sorry about the mess, guys. We're hosting Thanksgiving this year. This review would not be complete if we didn't go to the fast food mecca of Sonoma County. Roner Park, Sonoma County's fast food capital. They literally have everything here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get Popeyes from Roner Park and we're also gonna get Chick-fil-A from Roner Park and we're gonna see who has the best spicy chicken sandwich. Oh, by the way, I'm a certified drone pilot now. If you're curious about that, we can make the next show about this. So I don't know about you guys, but I remember growing up, KFC was like the champion of anything chicken. So I saw KFC here in Roner Park because Roner Park has all the fast food in the universe. So I'm gonna see if they have a spicy, spicy chicken sandwich here. Yeah, we had the crispy caramel sandwich and we put either the buffalo sauce or the natural hot sauce. Oh, okay. Does one of those sauces not have vinegar or are they both vinegar based? Both. They're both vinegar based? Yeah. Oh, okay, it's all right then. Thank you anyways though. Have a nice day. Likewise. So they have two spicy chicken sandwiches, but they're vinegar based. I can't do vinegar. That's why I'm gonna ask for my sandwich at Chick-fil-A with no pickles because I just don't like anything that has vinegar. So we made it to Popeyes. Boom. Roner Park Popeyes, baby. So we're gonna order a spicy chicken sandwich here and then we're gonna go over to uh, Chick-fil-A across the freeway and we're gonna order their spicy chicken deluxe. Are we gonna go sorry for you today? I was wondering if I could get a spicy chicken sandwich, please. Just a sandwich, anything else? Uh, just a sandwich by itself with no pickles. Yes, the spicy one. Anything else? Uh, that'll be it. So it's 434 for the spicy chicken sandwich. Here it is. Thank you. So here we got it. Boom. So now let's go. Let's park real quick. They made that really fast. That was that was an impressive speed. Has a little warmer on the side. Stick it in. Get it, zip it up. I'm gonna put it down here. Oops, oh, my daughter's toy's down there. Gonna put it there, and then we're gonna blast the heater just to give it a little bit of extra warmness. That's a life hack right there. You, uh, if, and if you have seat warmers, you could use the seat warmers also, but that's a little life hack I learned. So let's go to Chick Chick Filet. They always move quickly with their lines. So I'm not really too worried about the long line. It's a heater in here. I'm like, I have the windows open and I'm sweating. This car can get so hot. So I'm, I'm super confident that Popeyes is just cooking. Look, they're about to take our order. They're already, they're already up to us. Any order? Uh, Mustafa. How do you spell that? M-U-S-T-A-F-A. That's so cool. Thank you. Is your actual name? Yes, it is. Oh, it. <laughs> what can I get started for you? Um, we're gonna get the spicy chicken deluxe, please. Spicy chicken deluxe. Okay. Yes, no pickles. All right. Sandwich like... only. Okay, just a sandwich. Uh -huh. All righty. Anything else for you today? Um, 
No, I think that'll be it. All right, any sauces? No, thank you. All right, so it's spicy chicken deluxe, no pickles, and no sauce. Total comes up seven, or 586, and you're gonna be paying with Vader right up there. Okay, sounds great, thank you so much. Have a good one. Uh-huh. She like my name. So my name is like a huge conversation starter. Literally no one forgets me. Everyone remembers me because of my name. Sorry, I'm vlogging. Oh, you're all good. 586, so $6, so it's 586 here. We're doing uh, the spicy chicken deluxe versus the Popeye spicy oh, sandwich. Interesting. <laughs> yeah, so we'll see who wins. We're about to get our spicy chicken sandwich and all I can smell are the fries. I think hands down Chick-fil-A has the best fries. This test is not about that, but Chick-fil-A's fries are to die for. Like, if, if you think of any uh, better fries, leave them in the comments. Thank you so much. Here we have it. There they are. They're both nice and warm still. Um, I just checked them. So yeah, let's, uh, let's go do this test. So we're out here on the beautiful Windsor Town Green and we're about to open up the store because this is where we're going to be doing everything. Boom. Get the keys. Let's go in. Oh, got to turn off the alarm. Bum, 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 bum. Make sure they're still nice and oh my god, these are so warm. It, it worked. So here's Popeyes, here's Chick-fil-A, and let's get a nice thumbnail. Right here. That might be a good thumbnail. We'll see. This is a the Popeye spicy chicken sandwich. Comes in a bag like this, has aluminum. This one was, was cheaper, it doesn't have cheese, however. This is what it's looking like, straight out the box. And again, it's still like super warm. So here we are. That's kind of angled a little weird, but that's, uh, you know, that's it right there. And don't let looks fool you. Um, this thing's delicious. They're all delicious. I love chicken sandwiches. So here we have the Popeye spicy chicken sandwich. Now the Chick-fil-A here, this one comes in a cardboard box like this. So you prop this guy open. You look, this one looks delicious. This one just looks, it looks amazing. The, here they are side by side. So the, the Chick-fil-A one has, um, it has more stuff, it has cheese, it has tomato, it has lettuce. However, the Popeyes, they have their special sauce in there. And you know, that's, that's what, in my opinion, makes this one really, you know, a great sandwich, spicy chicken sandwich. In order to be able to do this comparison properly, we need criteria. They're all gonna be out of five. One of them is gonna be bun. How great is the bun? The crispiness, chicken. The actual chicken, just how good is the chicken? Which one's spicier? So we're gonna do the spicy factor. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. So Chick fil A gets the first bite of it. That's delicious. I don't remember it being this spicy. I haven't had one of these in a while. Definitely. It definitely has a, a big spicy factor. Nice and crispy. It's, you know, it's delicious. Both of these sandwiches, I already knew they were delicious. Mm. It has a spiciness factor, but it's like a different type of spicy. This spicy builds up slower and if, like now I'm starting to feel the spiciness. The Chick-fil-A sandwich didn't really have that. It was just like in your mouth. Like you, you could taste 
chili. I could tell that this bun, and you could see this bun, it's just glazed over. It's almost like a pretzel bun. It's a lot sweeter, so the sweetness just goes great with this sauce. It's, it's, it's fantastic. Start with the bun. The bun, this one, it's not, it's not exactly, like I really like uh, pretzel buns. I know that they're not the healthiest for you, but I'd probably give this bun, uh, let's say uh, 3.5 out of five. That's that bun. <laughs> this bun is just an average bun. No, nothing special. We'll go 2.5 out of 5. The other thing too, the, the sweetness, because usually you get spicy and then you balance it out with some type of sweetness. The sweetness in the bun is balancing out that sauce. Where here, again, you're getting the vegetables, the tomatoes that are balancing that out. But I think that without the mayo, it's really like just, like that's why it's hitting you so much harder. The chicken uh, quality on both of them. So let's get some close-ups of the chicken of the chicken now that it's been bitten. Here you can see the chicken's a lot um, smoother. It's a lot thicker. Here it's thinner, but look at how the chicken just hangs out. You know, on the side of the bun. This one doesn't. Is this is this is. Uh, it might be the same amount of chicken. This one's just thicker. This one's um, this one's flatter. If you're a chicken lover, this might be it for you. If you just like that, you know, fried taste, this might be it for you. The Chick Fil A. I like their chicken quality better. I, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and say they have a better chicken quality. So, let's give the, the Chick-fil-A a four out of five on the chicken quality. And this one would be probably like a 2.5 out of five. I like the crisp on the Popeyes better. I like this crispiness a lot better than this crispiness. This is more, Chick-fil-A is a little bit more breaded. This is more just that flaky goodness. So crispiness wise, I do the opposite. It'd be 3.5 for Popeyes and it'd be 2.5 for Chick-fil-A. Now spiciness, Chick-fil-A, it's spicier. The, I mean, it, it could vary batch to batch, but it's right now trying these. Chick-fil-A is spicier. So let's give the Chick-fil-A, we'll give it four out of five, because I mean, you feel it. And Popeyes is three out of five. Again, all of this is going to be based on your personal preferences. For example, the KFC ch spicy chicken sandwich isn't on here, either one of them, because I don't like vinegars. You might love vinegars. All in all, Chick-fil-A scored a 13 with our scoring system. Popeye scored 12.5, that's if you don't include price. If you include price, they're pretty much tied. They're both great sandwiches. Good shit. Cheers. I feel so spoiled doing this right now. This is like a dream come true for me. This is like what I live for. <laughs>